The heartbreaking reality of losing a pet can sometimes be too much to bear. It is a tragedy that leaves people devastated, so much so, they sometimes can't be there for their animal when they come to the end of their lives. Earlier this year, a tweet by US based Jessie Dietrich touched on such a moment, and her comments struck a chord with thousands around the world. Asked my vet what the hardest part was about his job and he said when he has to put an animal down 90% of owners don't actually want to be in the room when he injects them," she wrote. So the animal's last moments are usually them frantically looking around for their owners and that broke me. In response, Hillcrest Veterinary Hospital a clinic in KwaZulu-Natal South Africa shared a similar message, urging owners to care for their pets up until the very end. The post, written by a tired broken-hearted vet asked those taking their animals to the vet for a pain-free humane ending to not leave their animals, despite the fact staying may be devastating. I beg you do not leave them. Do not make them transition from life to death in a room of strangers in a place they don't like. The thing people need to know that most of you don't is that they search for you when you leave them behind. The post read. They search every face in the room for their beloved person. They don't understand why you left them when they are sick, scared, old or dying from cancer, and they need your comfort. Don't be a coward because you think it is just too hard for you. The moment is one that can be profoundly difficult, according to Melbourne vet Dr. Lauren Bujeha, who euthanizes elderly pets in their homes. But she told Mamania, animals are relaxed, and there are times when an owner is too upset to be in the same room, and they will need to leave. She said she has never had pets worried during their final moments because she spends time talking and comforting them with her nurse. If a pet is getting left alone in an unfamiliar environment like a vet clinic or consult room, then they would be more likely to be worried as they do not know where they are. For this reason, I would recommend staying in the room with your pet if you choose to do it at a clinic. Dr. Buje has said how a person copes with such a devastating event depends on the individual and she wouldn't ever pressure anyone to stay if it meant causing harm to their emotional well-being.